Hi, and welcome to Yoga Today. My name is Kame Brandenburg, and today I'm going to lead you through an intermediate Pilates core class using no props, just yourself and your mat. So meet me at the top of your mat in a seated position, and we'll begin with the feet planted and the knees together. Be a nice tall spine and extend your arms out in front of you. Let's make our way onto our back, engaging the core, pulling the abs in, finding that C-shaped curl, and table topping the legs. We'll start with short spine. So extend your arms down towards the mat and relax the shoulders away from the ears. Create a Pilates V with the feet by flexing them, keeping the heels together and toes apart. Take a deep inhale. On the exhale, extend your legs to 45 degrees and then lift your hips and toes overhead. Good, and on the inhale, keeping the heels together, open up the knees and slowly roll down spine, bone by bone, until you come all the way down to the mat and press back out to 45 degrees, starting again. Lift the hips, point the toes, overhead, hold. On the exhale, open up the knees, heels stay together, keeping the heels close to the glutes, roll down, articulating through the spine, and press back through to 45. Again, inhale, heels come up, toes overhead. Exhale, open up the knees, roll down the spine, nice and slow. Tailbone hits, extend back out two more times. Inhale, lift the hips. Exhale, open up the knees. Rolling down the spine with control. Roll back out to 45. Last time, inhale, feet come up overhead. Inhale, exhale, open the knees. Roll back down and stop right there. Keeping the legs in tabletop from here. Grab behind the legs. Inhale, curl yourself up and bring the hands behind your head, extending the legs out to 45 degrees. Hands come down, we'll start our 100, pumping here. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Eight more sets, keep pumping here. Shoulder tips stay off the mat. Maybe lower the legs a little bit more and keep breathing deeply. Inhale and exhale. Inhale. And exhale, halfway, two more. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. And breathe out. Two more sets. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. And take a rest. Nice work. Go ahead and extend the legs nice and long. As we get ready for our full roll up, again, continuing on, heels stay planted, flex the feet and toes to the sky, reach your fingertips up. Again, keep the heels anchored as you take that inhale, tuck the chin, reach up to the sky, exhale, forward fold, inhale, reach back up, shoulders down the back, tuck the abs in, tailbone comes underneath the body as you release down towards the mat and start again, four more times, inhale, Reach for the sky. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, work the opposition. Fingertips here as you pull the abs in. Think cannonball to belly as you come down all the way onto the mat. Three more here. Inhale. Try not to use momentum as you come up. Exhale, forward fold. All core strength. Inhale. Imagine that I'm pulling your fingertips as you travel backwards all the way down to the mat two more times inhale nice and strong exhale forward fold inhale fingertips reach jaw down working down the spine last one reaching the fingertips to the sky take an inhale and exhale forward fold Nice. Come up to a seated position and let's move to the top of your mat to get ready for your open leg rocker. So similar to rolling like a ball, we'll bring the heels together and the toes apart, creating that Pilates V. This time the grip will have the thumbs on the inside of the ankles and wrapping the rest of the fingers on the outside. Again, instead of having the tall spine, I want you to find that C-shaped curl and we'll begin by warming up each leg separately. So come onto the toes and extend one leg up and back down, sitting the weight back on the tailbone, 
stretching the back of the legs, finding a nice stretch for the hamstrings. Let's do this a few more times each leg. All the while we're pulling the abs in and scooping the belly, finding that C-shaped curl. All right, one, two, three. We're gonna lift both legs up together. Find that balance. Your V should be just about wide as your hips. Keep pointing here. Keep a nice strong spine. Inhale, roll back on the inhale. Exhale, come forward. <sighs> Balancing on your tailbone. And again, inhale, exhale. <sighs> nice, keep the chest open. Chin up. <sighs> Scoop the abs. Rock back and come forward. You've got it. Let's do this three more times. Rolling back to the shoulder tips. Rocking forward to find balance. Abs drawn in. Strong arms and legs. Last one. Scoop the abs. Rock back. Exhale. Come forward. Hold. Walk the legs together. Release them. Finding them in parallel. Slowly roll back all the way down to the mat. Hands come down and feet go to the sky, and we're ready for corkscrew. So lift your hips two to three inches off the mat, and as they come down, exhale, circle over to the left, stopping in the center, toes over your hips. Again, lift the hips, and this time circle to the right. Let's begin. Inhale, lift. Exhale, circle to the left. Inhale, lift. Exhale, circle to the right. And again, inhale, lift. Circle to the left. With precision, inhale, lift, circle to the right. Three more, inhale, lift, circle to the left. Inhale, exhale, circle, just the sides of the box of your body. Inhale, lift, exhale, circle. Inhale, lift, exhale, circle. Last set, hips lift. Exhale, circle, and lift. Circle to the right, and finish here. And extend the legs down towards the mat and plant them to get ready for your series of five. We'll start with the single leg stretch, legs in tabletop, grab behind the thighs to lift your shoulder tips off the mat. The intermediate grip is going to be your left hand on the inside of the knee and right hand on the outside of the ankle. And then we'll switch here and continue here for 10 more sets. One hand on the knee, outside hand on the ankle. For eight, and eight, seven, and seven. Go six, and six, five, and five. Curl up higher if you can, four, and four, three, and three. Switch two, and two, on one, and one. And bring it in, hold. Keeping your head lifted right into double leg stretch. Extend the arms and legs in opposite directions. Exhale, circle it in. Nine more times. Inhale, reach. Exhale, circle. <sighs> Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, circle. Send the legs out. Inhale. Exhale. Six more. Reach. Inhale. Exhale. Shoot the arms right past the ears. Exhale. Curl up higher. Inhale. And exhale. Four more. Reach. And circle. <sighs> For three. And circle for two, and circle, last one, and circle. Now rest the head, feet go to the sky, point the toes right into our scissor, grabbing behind the right calf. Pulse, pulse, switch, and pulse, pulse, switch. Let's go. To make this more challenging, reach up higher this time, and extend the opposite leg lower to the ground. You've got it, inhale, exhale, switch. Pulse, pulse, switch. Pulse, pulse, switch. Try to keep the hips anchored. Keep everything steady. <sighs> keep breathing. Four more. Pulse, pulse, switch. Pulse, pulse, switch. For three. And three. For two. And two. Last one. And one. Head comes down. Feet go to the sky. For your lower lift, bring the hands behind your head. Elbows nice and wide. Keeping the tailbone flat, inhale, exhale, lift up. Shoulder tips stay nice and high off the ground this time. Legs stay pinned straight for the intermediate version. Lowering down on the inhale, exhale, lift right back up. Nine more times, inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. 
Inhale, lower. Exhale, and you lift. Really finding the low abs here. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Keep working. Inhale. Exhale. Four more. Try not to swing the legs. All about strength and control here. Lower down. Inhale. Exhale to lift. Curl up higher. Last two. And lift. Last one. And lift. Tabletop the legs. And we'll finish with crisscross. Remembering to keep the elbows nice and wide. We'll rotate over to the left, extending the right leg. And rotate again. Nine more. Left and right, twisting from the center, brushing the legs right past each other for eight and eight, seven and seven, six and six. Rotate deeper, five and five. Opposite elbows off of the mat, opposite shoulders keep working. Let's go, almost there for three and three. Point the toes for two and two. Final one and one. Take a rest. Nice work. We've come to the last exercise in our intermediate series, which is gonna be our teaser. All right, let's begin with teaser prep. Extending the right leg to the sky, squeezing the knees together, fingertips to the sky. We'll reach up just once here, inhale, switch it out, and switch, and switch. Keep going until both legs are gonna meet. Last set, both legs up. Here's your teaser, lower all the way down. We're coming right back up. Nice, come back down, inhale. Exhale, use that core. Good, last one, you've got it, inhale. Exhale, we'll hold. Good, three, two, one, and slowly release. Finding a nice stretch. Lengthening through the body, hug the knees into your chest, cross your ankles, and rock a few times to come up to a seated position to finish your series. That was your intermediate Pilates core class. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'm looking forward to seeing you tomorrow on Yoga Today.